In this video I will show you the consumption of the Polestar 2 when towing a big huge uh, trailer. I'm sure the consumption will be pretty high considering the boxy shape of the trailer and its poor aerodynamics. So let's see how it goes. As always, if you enjoy my content, please consider to hit like and subscribe and comment below. So let's reset the counter and get going. Forty point three. Whoop, whoop. Okay, so we've dumped some old crap on the recycling station and now we're heading to the barbecue shop to get a new grill. So it's winter time soon but you can always barbecue. And we are getting the Traeger grill. Uh, Ironwood 650 I think. So this is going to be really exciting. So as you can see here, we have now 82% 80 battery and Google estimates, I'm not sure if you can see it if it's too bright, but Google estimates that when we arrive, we will have 73% battery. And I'm not sure with the consumption now that we have the big trailer behind, the consumption is really high. So it's going to be exciting to see if Google is adjusting for that or if it will be completely wrong. Let's see. Okay, we've arrived at the barbecue shop now and the car shows 69% charge. Remember it showed 73% charge before we started and we've just driven 24 kilometers. So it's clearly that Google did not account for the added uh, consumption with the big trailer. Usually Google is really good at estimating the consumption. so. Uh, it's clearly that uh, it's not taking into account that we have a big trailer behind now, uh, which uh, result in higher consumption. That's kind of expected, I guess. Okay, let's just go into the shop and uh, then load the new barbecue into the trailer and head back home. And uh, then we can see the end result. <laughs> Okay, we've arrived at home now and let's just sum up the numbers and uh, see what we can conclude with. So we've driven a total of 92.5 kilometers with uh, this huge uh, trailer behind. And we started with 94% charge leaving home. And uh, now that we've parked, we've ha we have 41% charge. So uh, we've used a total of 53% charge. The average consumption shows 41.1 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers. We've driven on slightly wet roads and uh, the average temperature has been around 5 to 6 degrees Celsius. So that's it for now. Uh, and as I mentioned earlier, if you enjoy my content, please consider to hit like and subscribe. See you.